You already know. What time it is June 18th, 2020. What's in the shop today? Fortnite. The trench trawler. Oh, what is that? What are you doing? The heavy hook looks good. Wow. It's like a lighthouse for his head. It almost reminds me of a fire hydrant. Look at the buoy on his hip as well. The backlink is the anchor. It looks to be slightly universal. No actual colors, just kind of like browns and metals aka steel if you guys would like to use me as your supporter creator that is p-i-z zero p-z with the zero the eyes are reactive thank you for telling me how it is actually reactive so at night the eyes will light up you know we're getting it yes yeah. the heavy hook i like this it's even got some textures on here as well i see a shark a star that everybody had tattooed on them in the early 2000s the nautical star regardless what does it sound like this music is just too much i can't even tell what it sounds like but we're gonna test it in game you know we're getting it yes so we have the mayhem weapon wrap we're using for the showcase the victory umbrella from this current season season three that you get rewarded for winning a game it just he is so dirty what is on his elbows what are those called not coral i don't know what they're called i want to get like a little 360 view of him here so he still has slight animation in the eyes right now during the daytime i believe it should work i'll just go into battle lab and make sure it's nighttime sometimes reactive things in the actual game and creative in terms of times of day are kind of wonky we'll try it out though regardless ads here is uh -uh. It's actually not terrible. It's not terrible at all. I love his striped shirt. Looking very, very sharp, my man. Dude, this harvesting tool looks amazing. Oh, it's going to be a sweaty harvesting tool. I'm calling it right now. It's going to be sweaty. I'm telling you. Wow, it looks so cool. Something so simple. So hitting opponents with shield. And without. All right, different materials. No colored streak. Default impact. But I don't know. I think it makes up for it. It looks really good just the way it looks. Um, it's weird how like it seems like my time of day changes. Depending on where I'm looking, like it seems like it it gets way bright. Maybe it, actually the clouds are changing my time of day, regardless. Change my material. I love cranking in steel. I'm telling you, love it. 90s are a little off today. Let me tell you. Skin, so the skin is fine, dude. It doesn't feel bad at all. I thought it was gonna feel kind of kind of bonk, bonky, wonky. And a glide real quick. It looks great with the victory umbrella too. It's just like all these different colors put together. Oh, this is a good skin. I like this. Very creative. I'll say that. Look at the buoy on his waist. Meet, 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 meet. Come. Ooh, I think that was it. Those looked a lot brighter. Oh, they're definitely brighter now. All right, the sun is down. There we go. That's what I was looking for. Can we actually see any ray of light from the player's POV? Not only when he's staring at you. So it, it's definitely animated. Oh man, it reminds me of that Disney movie with that robot where they just show the eyes. I don't even know what it's called. But that is a very cool little simple feature. I'm still not sure if the harvesting tool is worth a rare rarity. I, I, I love the thing. But there's nothing unique about it other than visual. There's no streak. There's no um, like colored impact at all i just really really enjoy the way it looks here so ads with the animation here the reactive portion at night i love that little feature there for sure i'm pretty much blown away at how much i'm enjoying this back blink it's one of those things where it reminds me of a traditional styled tattoo with the ribbon uh, keep in mind the ribbon is actually has a little bit of move even when you're not moving and it has the crack his tentacle on it which i think is a really cool feature here we got an oro it just makes sense 
Golden King. Skeleton King. I like that ribbon. It's just consistently slowly swaying as if it was underwater. And that's what I really like about this back bling. Ooh, that looks good. She's got edit styles too. She that looks so good. Most of the like diver underwater stuff I did include here. Got our boy Jonesy. I like this mask on too, but then it's like you can't even tell it's Jonesy anymore. Where is his hair? There's no way he got his hair in there, dude. Or that beard. There's no way. I don't believe it. The Reef Ranger. Raps County looks juicy. Cloudbreaker. Backs a million. All of these was just like it's very basic combos. I would say the back bling is really, really universal. A hundred percent universal. It's really fun to put it on. It's it's not like a bulky back bling, at least not to me. It doesn't get in the way. It's slightly canted to your um, non-shooting shoulder where you pocket your buttstock. So that is cool. It doesn't get in the way of that. This is great. Salt Trooper, very sweaty. My man Triggerfish, it looks great. This is what it came with. Trench Raider. Survival Specialist. Boxer. Boxy. Desert Dominator looks clean. Relay. And then Scorpion. So, back blinks on the Trench Trawler. There's some good ones here. The Royal Pack default. I try to go with the pants here. This reminds me of a parrot on the shoulder. That's a stretch. Not the mama! It's a stretch as well. The Mer Tank. The Mutiny Back Bling. The Shark Fin. Trash Lit. It kind of matches the... Almost like a DIY vibe to me. Shining Star will look really good with the lights animated at night because it's like a blue shine. So that's kind of like a... I thought it was a creative one. This is a stretch. This The original might look good too with the green that he has on his boots and like the cuffs around his wrist. What are those wrist cuffs? The clap trap goes well with his pants. The beach comber. I did that before you buy on Ocean today, by the way. Well, not before you buy. More of like just like a battle pass skin review. If you want to check that out, we have the air tank here. This is what it came with. The barrel and booty matches the vibe. Now that red goes great with like the lighthouse red he has on him. That is awesome. Dead card is kind of a stretch. I'm not going to lie. That's a stretch. I don't even know what to say about that. Dorsal Destroyer doesn't really match, but it's just a fun combo. He's got a little bit of orange on the booty, so that's definitely a stretch. Heavy Harvester looks good, but I don't know why he would wear that. But the same with a lot of these things. Pineapple Strummer matches the vibe. Quack Pack, need I say again, matches the vibe. Um, Doogie Bag, Doggy Bag. It kind of goes with the pants and the, the cufflinks on his wrist right there. He talks to Kitty. This one just kind of reminds me of like, he's in a lighthouse, almost similar shape. And then the back bling is in a similar shaped uh, mixer. That's a stretch for sure. And then Seaworthy has another edit style as well. My favorite one here. I really liked Trash Lid. I really liked Heavy Harvester too. Man, Birdshot. I don't know which one I like the best. There were some pretty strong ones here. Fairly universal on the combos live, we'll say that. A trench trawler for 1200. I'm not crazy about it in terms of color scheme, but we'll get to that. Two out of two for rarity. That is fine. Color scheme, I'll give it a one. It's a, that's a lot going on, but it is fairly unique. Does it match a decent amount? The skin, um, actually more surprising than I thought it was going to match. The back lean 100%, so 1.5 there. Is the outfit creative? Absolutely. Two out of two. Will I use it regularly? Mm, the back bling? Yeah. The skin? Possibly. I'll give it a one. Okay, math. Two, three, 4.5, 6.5, 7.5 out of 10. The trench trawler. The heavy hook coming in at a very affordable 800. Regardless, does it match the given rarity? This is where I'm torn. I don't think it matches the rarity. Um, in terms of uniqueness, sure, but we usually, I like to judge what it's worth given the visual effects as well. It was default across the boards in terms of swinging and impact. So I'm gonna give it a one on rarity. Color scheme, it's fairly universal. It's got some red. Other than that, you can use it with quite a lot. I'll give it a 1.5 on color scheme again. Equip sound, it sounds sharp. I'll give it a one there, kind of expected. Do you like the impact swing? I liked it. I liked that. 
Will they use it regularly? I will. Now, Vision is my favorite pickaxe in the game other than Death Valley. And that is a rare as well, but I don't think this is worth a rare rarity. So we got, what do we got? Two, four, six, 7.5. All right, didn't plan it. 7.5 out of 10 for the heavy hook. Yoink. And with that being said, guys, liking the video is always appreciated. Subscribing is free. That is P-I-Z-0 in the item shop. Thank you guys so much for watching. And we'll see you nerds on the live stream. See ya.